Hey Scribblers, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Greg Guntanas, author of the Lance Gadrin Mystery Series, now available on Amazon in ebook and paperback. I release a lot of writing and publishing related content on my channel, so make sure you subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. All right, in today's video, it's kind of a fun one, I wanted to go through how I hit the Amazon Top 50 on day one of my Kindle free ebook promotion. Now, for those that don't know, whenever you are exclusive to Amazon and you have taken part in their Kindle Select program, it places your ebooks in the Kindle Unlimited program, which is sort of like the Netflix for books where subscribers pay about $9.99 a month and those ebooks that are in the program they allow them to download basically an unlimited number of books but for the purposes of this video one of the additional benefits of being in that Kindle Select program is that Amazon allows you to do two different promotional things with your ebooks and one of them is a Kindle countdown deal where for five days you can have your Kindle book drastically discounted and readers that go on Amazon will see a sort of ticking clock when that deal ends and obviously the hope there is that will spur some more sales and one of the other promotional tactics that Amazon allows in that Kindle Unlimited or Kim sorry Kindle Select program is the Kindle free book promotion. So for five days, you get to place your ebook free in the Kindle store. And essentially, the, the hope there or the purpose there would be to gain more visibility and perhaps more reviews. So I, I've had a lot of people ask me, well, if I'm not getting sales, is there really a purpose to doing a Kindle free book promotion? Well, I think you'll see in this video that I am a proponent of the Kindle free ebook promotion. Even if it's only for five days, you'll find that it will give you a boost in various categories. It will give you a little bit more visibility and hopefully it'll give you a lot more reviews. So I'm going to talk about day one of my Kindle book promotion. This was specifically on book one, The Night Contract. That's the very first book in my Lance Gedron series. And my strategy going into this was I wanted to try the Kindle free book uh, promotion for five days while keeping book two of my Lance Gedron series at the normal rate. And I wanted to see how many reviews I got out of the free book promotion, how many reviews I got ultimately for book one, and also I was curious how many sales did I would I get for book two. So what I noticed right off the bat was that on Kindle, um, on this free book promotion, I shot up the charts on day one, and I think primarily it's because I did do a paid promotion. I only did one of those promotions on day one, and it's a free booksy feature. So even though my book was free, I wanted to push book one, the night contract, to as many possible readers as I could. So for those of you that don't know what free booksy is, it's basically a promotion site where authors can pay a fee and essentially your book, if it's free, is blasted to a very large email list. So I have the free booksy website pulled up here and essentially what I did and what any author can do if they're interested is you go to four authors and free booksy does have two different uh, features. And they've even added a series one, but we're not going to get into that. But basically, if your book is going to be free on a specific day, or perhaps it's perma-free if you're distributing your book across multiple platforms, you would do a free booksy feature. Now, if your book is discounted between $0.99 cents and $5, dollars 
you would do a bargain booksy feature. But for the purposes of this video, we're going to be talking about how I hit the Amazon Top 50 um, in the free store on day one of that free ebook promo. And primarily, I hit that Top 50 because of this free booksy feature. And I'll show you the data. So when you go to buy a free booksy feature, you'll quickly see just the vast enormity of their mailing lists. So depending on your genre, some of these have upwards of 400,000 people that are on these mailing lists. Now, I write mysteries, and luckily for me, the mystery list for free booksy is blasted to 427,000 potential readers. Now, obviously, the price is a little bit on the higher end compared to some of these other genres that may have a little bit less readers. However, my whole intent in going into this was I wanted to not only test out this book promotion site, but I wanted to really see did this directly impact my downloads and my visibility. So I did end up purchasing a free booksy uh, feature on March 10th of last month, and it was $100. And basically what ended up happening was on March 10th, after that full day, I shot up the charts and I was just absolutely flabbergasted by this. So I have here in this other tab my reports from that period of time. So I had a my five days in the free book promotion were from the 10th to the 14th. Now March 10th was the very first day of my Kindle free ebook promotion for the night contract, and that's the day that I only did free booksy. I didn't do another book promotion site that day. I didn't blast out to my mailing list. I only use free booksy. Now, if we look here at the data, I had 2,647 ebooks downloaded on that very first day. And Basically, that was enough to get me into the Amazon top 50. So I'm going to pull up a screenshot here. I took a screenshot the following day into the early afternoon after this promo had, had kicked in. And I was at number 48 in the Kindle free store. Now, I never got higher than 48, but I was absolutely stunned and absolutely amazed that I was getting that high up in the store, competing with so many other authors and competing with people that have tons of books in their backlist and competing in a genre that is already very competitive in the mystery genre. And as you can see, I hit the top 50 with only five reviews, while all these other books that were ahead of me had far more reviews, and I imagine a bigger backlist. Now, what did that day one of my promo do for my category ranks? Well, let me show you some screenshots here of the categories. March 10th, about 8.54. PM, I was number two in the mystery series in the top 100 free. March 10th, number two in Vigilante Justice, and number two in the Private Investigator Mystery. So not only did I crack the top 50 on all of Amazon, but in these various categories that my book was listed in, I just absolutely shot up the charts. And what you'll find is once you start shooting up the charts in these various categories, you're getting all this exposure from Amazon. You're getting all these potential readers that are flocking to you and your downloads are just going to be absolutely out of control. Now, how did I reach this point 
to get to the top 50. I think it's a combination of the free books you feature. However, it's also a combination of how I have packaged my book. And I think that's important to underscore here. So if I pull up the actual feature the day it ran, this is what it looked like on the free booksy website. So once you purchase that feature, they blast it on their website, on their Facebook page, and they blast it on their, their actual email list. So this is how my feature looked on day one of the promo, March 10th. I had my cover and I had a short little blurb about the book and I wanted to draw these readers in and make them want to read more. So I wrote, heavyweight champion boxer who loves pancakes and trouble. In this witty and gritty start to the series, Gedrin wants answers after his lawyer goes missing. She got him out on appeal after 12 years in the slammer for a brutal crime he didn't commit. But he better work fast. The state can still retry him for murder. So I really wanted to highlight the stakes that were at play in book one. I really wanted to highlight that this was the start to a series. So if readers were sort of on the fence or were curious, that they would know that there were other books in this series. So I kept it short. I had a nice cover. I had it nicely packaged. And this is basically what got me to the top 50 in the Amazon store on day one of that promo. Now, did I only get downloads out of this? Like, is that the only benefit? And I would say absolutely not, because not only was I getting downloads, but I was getting a substantial amount of reviews or ratings as they have on the Amazon system. So I showed you the screenshots earlier where I had five ratings. Now let's click on the link, and this is going to show you what it looks like today as I'm doing this video. I went from five all the way to 32. And that's just in the span of a little bit over a month. My reviews or ratings are sort of kicking up and I attribute basically all of this to this free book promotion period where this vast amount of downloads was just spurring this visibility and pushing Gedrin up the charts. Now, on the subsequent four other days of my promo, I did dabble with some lesser known promo sites, and I can get into that in another video. But this basically was to show you that even on day one, you can get that book high up off the charts. And not only can you get it high up off the charts, you can get it there without a big backlist and without a gargantuan number of reviews. But I think you have to package your book properly. So here I've taken a lot of time and a lot of effort in my covers, and I've talked about that in, in prior videos. Once somebody looks at my cover on Amazon, they know right off the bat that this is a mystery or this is a thriller, and they know just from the color scheme and the way the cover is laid out that it's probably going to have some action in it, and it's probably going to have some grittiness to it. Furthermore, my actual blurb here that I wrote, it's very short. It hooks the reader in, and it has that clear call to action for the reader to buy the book. So basically, that's how I did it. Um, I, I packaged everything right. I did do a, a nice promo there that did spur Gedrin to the top there. Now, obviously, I would have liked to get even higher up on the list, but of course, for my first free book promo, I think that, that it was just excellent and it, it blew past all my expectations. I surpassed all my expectations with that. Now, can you do this without a paid promotion? Possibly. I think it depends on how much you already have out there. If you're a well-established indie author and you have 10, maybe 20 books out there, a lot of times you release a book, you put one of them free, and just based on the sheer number of other books that are out there and your fandom already, you might crack that top 50 free on the first day as well. But in my case, 
I was a newer indie author. I just published the first two books this past November. Didn't have that many reviews out. I was trying to find any way I could to get my book some visibility. So yes, I did end up paying that $100 for the free booksy feature, but I feel honestly that it was worth it given the ratings that I've gotten since then and given how high up Gedrin did move up the charts. So I hope this video shed a little bit of light on some of these free book promos. Now, I can in another video sort of get into the, the nitty gritty of how you actually set it up on your KDP page. I'll, I'll maybe do a demo on that later. But for me, I really like doing this uh, Kindle ebook promo coupled with a solid paid promotion. So hope this video um, entertained you or shed a little bit of light on these promo tools that Amazon has. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments for scribblers out there, leave them down below. If you tried another promo site and you had some great results, or maybe you didn't have some great results, hit me up in the comments. I like hearing from all the fellow writers out there. So there you have it. I'll see all of you in the next video. And make sure if you've made it all the way to the end of this video and you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. It's a way for YouTube to see if my content is resonating with other scribblers out there. So that's it. Keep scribbling.